What? Stop it! Stop it at once! Oh, for goodness sake, it's six o'clock in the morning. I always wake up at six o'clock and I always practice before breakfast. Fine. Then let's go downstairs and I'll make you breakfast right now. All clear. Operation Bye Bye Margaret is a go! Ugh! Girl stuff! In my room! Doing? Nothing. Um, nothing. I'm, uh, I'm just writing in my diary. Diary? Oh, I didn't know you had a diary. It's secret. My secret thoughts. Not to be read by the likes of you, which is why I keep it in this box, which I lock with this key. And that's where it stays. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have teeth to clean. Once a snoop, always a snoop. <laughs> Dear Diary, I'm really, really worried that she's going to put Peter in the rubbish bin. Hmm. Peter would never tell on a guest, so I'd be blamed and really, really punished. <laughs> My life would be over and it had all be Margaret's fault. <gasps> When I said your wish is my command, this wasn't exactly what I had in mind. Uh, what are you going to do? Tell? I could never tell on a guest. Huh, good. Watch your fingers. Oh, over here. Don't forget this one. <laughs> no, 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 no. Henry's going to get it. Oh. <laughs> Operation Bye Bye Margaret, phase two. Email send. Henry, have you seen Peter? Yes. He's gone to live at the dump because he's rubbish. <gasps> Peter! 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 <laughs> Operation Bye Bye Margaret! <sighs> Henry, I warned you what would happen if you did this again. I didn't do it! Ask Peter who did it. Well? Um... Remember, never tell on a guest. Remember, never tell a lie. You're right. I have to tell the truth. It was... Margaret! <gasps> Margaret? How could you be so horrid? Oh, you set me up. And why did you throw all my stuff out the window? I did what? You did what? <gasps> <gasps> this is disgraceful behaviour, young lady. If your parents were here, you would be on your way home. Hold that thought. Oh, who can that be? We're so sorry Margaret's been causing trouble. We came as soon as we got your email. What email? Don't think you won't be punished, young lady. But you're coming home with us right now. I'll have your stuff sent over. Oh. <sighs> She's gone. Yes. <laughs> you sent that email, didn't you? You know what this means, don't you? No sweets for ten years. No TV until I can drive. But it was worth it. Yes, I sent the email. <clears throat> well, that was a really horrid thing to do, Henry. So, <clears throat> um, go to your room. Go to my room? That's it? Yes, go to your room. My room! It's so easy being me. I'm Margaret! 
You're Henry's partner for this race. What? Hurry up. It's about to start. On your marks. I'm in charge, Henry, and I want to win, so you'll do exactly what I say. Get set. No. I want to get sent home, so you do what I say. You reckon? I reckon. Uh, this way! No! This way! Ow! 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 Oh, this is more like it! Henry! Oh, Henry! Ow! Stop that at once! Ow! We wouldn't win. That's it. This race is cancelled. Oh, and Henry, you horrid child! If you think I'm going to send you home, you're wrong. You are here all day. The rest of you follow me. <laughs> You'll pay for this, Henry. That's the trouble with Sports Day. Brings out the worst in people. Um, um, <sighs> Don't worry, Ted. The eggs are hard boiled. <laughs> Ready? Get set? Go! And nobody moves until I find out who brought those eggs. I can't tell a lie, Miss Battleaxe. Well, it was Peter. <laughs> Take your places for the last race of the day. The 400 metres. I'm going to beat you this time, Henry. Oh, who cares? It's just a stupid race. That's your problem, Henry. You don't care about anything, which is why you never win. That's not true. On your marks. And the overall winner of every single thing in the entire world is... Henry! Get set! Hey, Henry. I bet you you lost gummy fuzzball, I win. Fuzzball? Fuzzball? You wake up! That's it! Sweets! Oh! Hey! Anybody want to swim? Do it! Oi! Ow! Ow! One last gummy fuzzball! I'm coming your way! Go on! You know you want it! Yes! 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 Well done, Henry! You are the school's new 400 metres champion! Thing. She's going to be so disappointed in me. Here, Worm. So are this. But this is your trophy. No, this is my trophy. That's the egg and spoon one. <gasps> you took it. The race was cancelled. Why would they need it? It's yours. <laughs> it's so easy being me. I'm At 
least there's one place I'm safe from greasy Greta. Treats? Doesn't anybody have any treats? If you don't tell me where Margaret has hidden her treats, then it's back to school dinners for you, Andrew. I hear it's stringy stew today. Huh? In her socks? <laughs> <laughs> Take a couple of these to school tomorrow, Henry. What's the point? The demon dinner lady will only scoff them. Don't touch them. They're hot. Aha! Uh -huh. Extra hot chilli powder. <laughs> now they're extra, extra hot! out now and go to sleep, please. But, Mum, there's a demon dinner lady at school and she's taking all our treats. Oh, that's nice. Night-night. There must be a way to stop her. There must. There must. No more. No, no more. I demand to know who's the, the smarty pants who did this terrible thing to poor Greta. Or it's back to school dinners for the lot of you. Miss, I am Smarty Pants. No, Miss, I am Smarty Pants. No, Miss, I am Smarty Pants. No, no. I, I am Smarty Pants. Eureka! That's it! This is more than just a one kid job. Alone, Greasy Greta can just chew us up and spit us out. But together, we are indigestible! Henry, pipe down and go to sleep. We can do it. Work with you, no way. But we can only stop her if we stick together. <laughs> We'd all get into trouble. But we've got to do something. Yes, she's getting stranger and stranger. Oh, too many treats are bad for you. She can't stop herself. That's why my plan will work. No, it won't. Will it? I don't know. Treats, treats. Intruder in the house! Come quickly! An intruder! 
don't worry, son. We'll have a squad car over there in no time. Now, what's this intruder look like? Ten feet tall, teeth the size of icebergs, and she's watching our TV right now! But that's Rebecca. She's not an intruder. was the intruder and took her away. Does that mean I win hide-and-seek? No. You most definitely haven't won hide-and-seek. Intruder, am I? Ten feet tall, am I? Teeth like icebergs, have I? Uh, it wasn't my idea. I think you're very uh, charming. Get to bed. You have five seconds. One. Run! from that bed, or you'll be sorry you were born! This is not good for my reputation. I hope nobody finds out I went to bed two whole hours before my bedtime. Henry, it's me, Peter. I came to see what you're going to do. Do? Well, you're Henry. You're not going to take this lying down. No, no, I'm not. Because no one tells Henry what to do. This is our house. We have rights. We will not be bullied. We will stand up to the oppressor. We will gain our freedom. Because I am Henry. And you are Peter. Um, I think I'll stay in my room. Worm. <coughs> ah, spider! Ah! <sighs> Oh, it's just a stupid toy. <sighs> Eureka! That's it! Are we free yet? We need a spider. Spider? Any particular species? Yeah, a big one. Perfect! Now, scream for help. Pretty good. Oh, thank you. Why aren't you in bed? Spider. and get rid of the spiders. Can I watch Mutant Max? Yes. And stay up till my parents come home? Yes. And eat all the ice cream in the fridge? Yes. Just get rid of that... that... thing. Deal! I think I'll take them to school tomorrow. Right. Back to bed, both of you, now! Uh, we agreed. Tough. Deal's off. A oh, simple thank you would have been nice. If the deal's off, you can have the spiders back. <laughs> Henry, maybe you should stop. It's not nice to scare others. She broke her promise. True. Grown-ups shouldn't make promises and not keep them. <laughs> You repellent, repulsive, repugnant, reptilian rat! Massive Mutant Max! Parents! Coming, ready or not! Right, you little worm, I'm going to take you apart limb by limb! Henry? <gasps> I was just leaving. It's so easy. I think Dad's really gonna like having me.
made me going to work with him. Loads better than having Stinky Peter. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be really, really fine. Henry, not that one! Oh! This is not a good start, Henry. Nowhere near good. You've already been horrid and we're not even at my desk yet. But, Dad, we're being cut out by firefighters! This is great! An office is a place where people come to work, not to muck about. I want perfect behaviour. My boss is very strict, so don't let me down, eh? Dad, you can count on me. Oh! Ow! You're late. Bad start. Bob knows best and late people aren't great people. Sorry, Bob, sir. I, um, hit the alarm button by accident. Dad just told a fib. Hmm. This is just like school. Henry, this is Bob, my boss. And you have to do everything he tells you. And this is Bill, his son. And you have to do what I say too. Welcome to my brush and paste empire, young Henry. We aim to have a foaming brush in every mouth in the land. So, take this day by the scruff of the neck, little laddie. Listen and learn. And one day you too could take orders from me. I'll try my best, sir, Bob, sir. I, I promise to listen and learn. I like you, young Henry. I wish more young men wanted to be like me. Tell you what, you can be my son's partner for the day. Whoa. I expect my boy Bill to take toothpaste into the future. Watch him like a hawk, Henry. My boy is the future. You heard Bob, Sir Henry. Do everything he says and everything Bill says. Yes, sir, a Bob, sir. Meeting in the boardroom in five. All hands on deck. First task, boys, make the tea, serve the tea. And remember, I could be watching you. Remember, Henry, do everything they say. Oh, we have to make all these. Are you kidding? I got better things to do than listen to Dad give orders. Great! What will we do instead? You don't get it, do you? You make the tea, I watch you. No way! If you don't do what I say, my dad will fire your dad. So get making, Bucket Brain. Good. Now I order you to put this stuff in the tea. Remember, do everything he says. Well, if that's an order. Well done. Lovely tea, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> this tea's been tampered with. Who did this? It was Henry, Dad. I tried to stop him, but he wouldn't listen. But he told me to! And you said I had to do everything he told me to do! No excuses! You should keep your son under more control! You need to learn what hard work is, Henry. I want you both down in the packing department now! I'll get you for this, snot brain! No, you won't, because my dad is a boss and there's nothing you can do about it. You'd better help or I'll quit. Dead or not, you'll get into trouble again. And you're not working fast enough. Ah, look at that. Dad hates to waste toothpaste more than anything. He's gonna be really angry. Gotcha! <laughs> Don't be horrid, Henry. I tried to stop him, Dad, but he won't listen to me. <gasps> it's so easy being me. I'm horrid, Henry.
Hello, Hello Daddy! Daddy! Hello! You can come in if you've brought a present. Don't be horrid, Henry. Ralph's at the dentist. His mum's going to drop him off when he's finished. You'll have to start without him. OK. Go! This is from... I know! It's a pack of felt pens. Do you like it, Henry? Mm, I've already got some. Henry, what do you say? Thank you very much. Next! It's a tapestry kit. I chose it myself. Why? Oh, I'll have it if you don't want it, Henry. Brilliant! You've got some animal soap, a CD of fairy tales. Oh, wow! Cook your own healthy, nutritious food! Fantastic! <laughs> what do you say to everyone, Henry? <laughs> Henry! Can this party possibly get any worse? Party games, everyone? Yep, you can. <sighs> pass it on, Henry. Yeah, look, like, pass it on, Henry. <sighs> Come on, Henry, pass it on. All right. Here you go, worm. <laughs> Be horrid, Henry! Now, who wants to play musical statues? Ooh. He moved! Didn't? Yo pushed me! Did not! Did! Henry, I'm warning you. Yes, Henry! We're having fun! No, we're not! This is fun! Yeah! Go kill a rat! Let's dance! <laughs> Henry, look who's here! Nay, no, nay! No, 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 no. Mom! It'll have to wait till later, Henry. Tea's ready. At least tea's going to be good! Sticks. Want a crisp? No thanks, Henry. I'm staying fit and healthy. Henry, you were right. This is a good party. This is the worst party ever. This is another rubbish present, too. All right! That's more like it! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's party! Perfume. I thought she'd never notice. And where's Peter? 
He's not in his room. I gave it to Ralph. Well, you go round to Ralph's right now and get him back, you horrid boy. But I don't want him back. Henry, go and get your brother back right now. When I'm king, parents won't be allowed to have any pocket money. Henry. Mum says I've got to get Peter back. Uh, no. Yeah. Huh? With Margaret. Margaret's house? Oh, no. When I'm king, Yet. Sorry, Margaret. <sighs> well, we don't want them now you've tossed them all around the countryside. Go and get some drinks. And don't spill a drop or I'll make you wish you'd never been born. <sighs> yeah, never been born. Henry, have you come to rescue me? Uh, no, can't. Please, I'll do anything. You can keep the 20p. I'll pay you 50. A pound. She's horrible. Nearly as bad as you. <laughs> Come back. I'll give you all my money. All right. I'll see what I can do. Oh, thank you, Henry. Where's my drink? My mum says I have to get Peter back. Well, you can't. You break it! That's it! Hey, what if I take his place? You? Um, no. You'd be hopeless. Oh, yeah, hopeless, Henry. <laughs> I'd be great. And you'd get to boss me about. Boss you around? Hmm, that's worth a lot. All right, but I want my money's worth. I promise. I had to pay ten pounds. Oh, thank you, Henry. I'll pay you back. I'm free. I'm free. Henry! Hurry up! Coming. Your drinks, ladies. Too late. I've got to go now. You should have been quicker. You're going to have to smarten your ideas up. But don't interrupt. I'm going to see Susan out. Then I want fresh nuts, a decent drink with more ice, and my cushions plumped. Got it! Got it! Right. Operation Free Henry is a go! Margaret. Miss Margaret to you. That's better. When you've finished, you can go and clean all my shoes. Uh... Ah! <gasps> what happened? Oh, must be faulty. Hmm. It was all right before. Ah! Oh! 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 <laughs> Over here, Miss Margaret! <laughs> You did this. I hate you. Ah! Not my fault if none of your stuff works properly, is it? Go away. Just go away, Henry. You're horrid. But I've sworn to serve you. <sighs> ah! Get out. I'm so rich. <laughs> That's a lot of money, Henry. Yeah. I earned it. I'm going to buy a new castle and a new football and a... Are you sure you'll have enough left over? Huh? What do you mean, left over? This isn't the way to the toy shop. It's so easy being me. I'm This 
is Miss Oddbod. Is that Henry? Uh, no, th th this is Peter, Henry's snotty-nosed little brother. Oh, right. Well, is your mother there? I need to speak to her about Henry missing his spelling test. No, she's not. Uh, I mean, no, she's out. And by the way, Henry won't be coming back to school ever again. No? Really? Why? He's got such a high temperature uh, that his brains have melted all over the floor. Sorry, I've got, got to go and clean them up. Bye! Oh! Henry, where's my drink? And where's my ice cream? Oh. When I'm king, only one person at a time will be allowed to be sick. And that will be me! Henry, is that the post? Would you bring it up? Oh. It's just no fun being good. Ah! <laughs> Henry, answer the door, please. Hello, Sonny. Mum or Dad at home? Mum is, but she's sick. Left me to clean up. Ugh. I'll call her if you want. Mum! Hello, oh, no, 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 don't bother her. Uh, just pass on a message. We're making some repairs and we've got to turn the water off for a couple of hours. Stop it, Fluffy. That's Peter's. Ugh. Ugh. We'll let you know when we've finished. Henry! Oh, coming! <laughs> Fluffy, that's only for sick people. Who was at the door? A man. They're turning the water off. Oh, no. Not today. Oh, I'd forgotten all about it. Henry, listen. You need to fill the bath, then fill saucepans, um, water jugs and uh, everything else you can find. And hurry! And take Peter his ice cream. On. Make sure your taps are all turned off. Oh, great! Someone else telling me what to do. What? Anything else you want? Hot water bottle? Nice fluffy blanket? Um, no thanks. Uh, have a nice day. Have a nice day? Oh, yeah! I'll put it on the list. Silence. No one's yelling at me to do something. At last. Whoa! Oh, Henry, I feel absolutely awful. I'm going to bed. Yeah, well, well Mum's sick too, and I had to get her juice. And Peter wanted ice cream, and, and Miss Ombob phoned, and the waterman came, and I had to fill everything, and then. Oh! <laughs> oh. And nobody turned off the taps. It's so easy being me. I'm I'm 
feeling my way out. Oh, stupid spoon. Right, that's enough. To work. Henry, you can't leave. You're really mean. No, I'm not. I don't like you very much, that's all. That's not true, because you saved me. Saved you? When? When I was little. Henry. Look, you've made Peter cry again. I warned you. No, Mummy. Look, bad doggy. <gasps> oh. You saved me. You're my hero. I never saved you. I got rid of the dog because... because... because he was going to get Mr Kill. I shouted at it to save Mr Kill. Not you. That's not true. You... you saved me. Uh-uh. I wouldn't have cared if that dog had eaten both your legs and your nose. I wouldn't have cared if... It's lunchtime, but you can't eat until after your tests, so stop ringing the bell. Oh, that's not fair! Hospitals always give you yucky jelly. I won't want yucky jelly! At least I'm missing school. That's fair. Go away! Henry, your mother said we could visit. How are you feeling? Depends. Did you bring homework? No. Then I'm fine. Good. We were so worried when we heard you'd been kept in hospital overnight. Weren't we, Margaret? You were. <sighs> Can we just give him the card? What card? The class made a card. Even I signed it. It says, Get well, hero. You're a hero, Henry, for saving your little brother. Everyone knows. You're going to take your card, you ungrateful pig. I'd rather you got me something to eat. Uh, sorry, I don't think you're allowed food. No, you're going to have a brain scan because they're not sure if you've got one. Oh, I'm out of here. Get better soon, Henry. And uh, if your parents think you should stay home for a while, that's fine with me. <laughs> what a disaster. My reputation's ruined. Just you wait. People will start calling me Hero Henry. It's not fair! And I'm so hungry! No one cares that I'm hungry but me. So I'm going to find some food. Don't worry. The scan is a routine one. And then you can take Henry home. Thank goodness. Henry, are you feeling better? Great. Have you got any money? What? Yes. Uh, no. Listen, I saved your life, right? And all I want in return is some of your money. Now. Oh, OK. It's so easy being me. I'm Henry. <sighs> Why didn't you pass the ball to me? Uh, I need to 
decided who you're taking to the game yet? All right, I'll take you! Team, one nil. Ha! We'll see about that. Gorinda, over here! Uh... To my Henry! No way! Kai, we're on the same side. It did a wash name right in my eye. I can't see any bird. Bird? Why didn't you try to save it? Uh, I don't know. Two one to Margaret's team. One minute to go. Right, no more, Mr. Nice Guy. Uh, uh, what should I do? To me! To me! such a disgraceful display of bad sportsmanship. Cheating, bulging, shoving. None of you deserves to be player of the match. But, Miss! I have decided that there will be a penalty shootout. Henry versus Margaret. OK, cool. Ralph can be in goal. No, Henry. This time, to avoid any possibility of cheating, you'll play against each other. You're in goal first. You're going to look pretty stupid, Henry, when you're beaten by a girl. Shows what you know about football. That was my famous bottom deflection move. Miss, <laughs> it's not fair! Swap places. You're in goal, Margaret. Oh. You're going to have to do a lot better than that, Henry. Come along, we haven't got all day. Goal! Yes! I did it, I did it! Well, I'm the one who scored the goal, so I must be player of the match. You mean? Absolutely. I get the tickets. But that's not fair! I can't believe Miss Battleaxe took the tickets. What does she care about football? Football? Ha! What good is this to me? Now, Mother, I'm not travelling all the way to Manchester to go up with a bunch of overpaid oits kicking a ball around. But, Mother, there must be someone else you could go with. Ah, young man. I know you, don't I? Yes, you're that nice young man who helped me this morning. Here. You can have this. No, Mother, you can't. Not him. Why not? It's my ticket. I'll give it to who I'd like. It's so easy being me. I'm Horrid Henry. Go ahead. I'll keep guard with the torch. Wow. 
werewolves don't like light. There. <laughs> now he's safe from the werewolf. Oh, it's really dark in here. <laughs> and smelly. <laughs> and me. Peter. Peter? Um, asleep? Uh, Henry took my torch and left me in the toilet. Henry! I know! I'm horrid! Send me home, please! Oh, no, you don't. Your father wants to be close to nature, and that's what we're doing. Why couldn't we camp in our back garden? That's close to nature. And proper toilets, too. Nonsense! This is our holiday. Come on, Peter. I thought holidays were supposed to be fun for everybody. Nature! <laughs> Eureka! That's it! They want to be close to nature? Then they're gonna be close to nature! Drizzle? Oh, I love walking in the rain. <laughs> Don't be horrid, Henry. I'm not going. Fine. You stay here and collect wood for the fire. Me? Where am I supposed to find wood? In the wood. Where else? And make sure it's dry. Dad's 
said I could push the trolley. You did it last time. Dad! Henry's being mean! Don't be horrid, Henry. It's OK. Peter can push. I don't care what... What did you say? Peter can push the trolley. I don't mind. Are you feeling OK, Henry? Fine, thank you. Um, well... Well done. Well done, then. Being good is really hard work. Hmm. I don't know. How about leek and broccoli? Um, yes, but Mum likes spicy parsnip. Fine. Henry, we need baked beans. I know where they are, Dad. It's OK. I'm on to it. <laughs> this has possibilities. <gasps> Henry, don't! Oops! Nearly forgot. Henry, what are you doing? Get down from there. It's OK, Dad. I've got it. Whoa! Oh, I've got the baked beans, Dad. Lunchtime. Peter, can you... Lay the table? Yes, please. Why can't I do it? Well, I want to lay the table. All right, Henry, but don't break anything. I always lay the table. Let go! You let go. OK, have it your way. Thank you, Peter. What a good boy you are. Henry, sit up properly. I am sitting up properly. Oh, so you are. Well, don't slurp your food. I'm not slurping. I've eaten all my carrots. Good heavens. Henry, what a good boy. Oh, I've eaten all my carrots too. Mm. <sniffs> Peter kicked me! Peter? I know what you're doing. You're only being good so you can go to the fair, but it won't work, so there. Oh, no? No, because sooner or later you'll do something horrid. You always do, smelly. I forgive you. Mum, can I do some gardening? You? Why? To be helpful, of course. Well, um, there is one job needs doing. Yuck! You said you wanted to help. It's good for the roses. Ugh! Shoveling poo! This had better be worth it. There he is. Ha! Enemy ahoy! Go away, Margaret. Captain Margaret, to you! Prepare to do battle! Charge! Surrender, worm! OK. What? I surrender. No! First you've got to fight so we can tie you up and make you walk the plank. Then you surrender. Not today. Oh, what's the point? Come on, Peter. Let's go and play mummies and daddies. Mm, come back! You've got to make him fight! <laughs> nice try, Peter. <sighs> Henry! You wouldn't dare. Henry, I... <sighs> Peter? Why did you do that? Because Henry won't be horrid to me! Peter, that is the silliest thing I have ever heard. Henry, I've changed my mind. You can come to the fair. <laughs> <laughs>